It's been decades since Erie had its own police athletic league. This summer, that changed. Kristen Nielsen attended the graduation ceremony today. She joins us now with more. Kristen. That's right, Jill. This year, with support from the police chief as well as the Erie County Sheriff, Erie was able to bring back their police athletic league. This program fosters relationships between law enforcement and youth in the community, as well as personal growth for all involved. Police officers are always there to help you. And they're to help you and they're to save others too. Over 60 children and about a dozen or so local law enforcement officers attended the first annual Police Athletic League summer camp. The program builds relationships between youth and law enforcement. During the week-long course, the campers also built on their own social skills. Those who organize the program say Erie's Police Athletic League has a unique factor to it. Uh, the Erie Police Athletic League is particularly uh, unique because it has the support of both the Erie County Sheriff and the Erie Chief of Police, which is one of the only police athletic leagues in the United States that has both the Sheriff's Department and the Police Department working side by side. During the graduation, participants were presented with various awards representing their personal achievements during their time in the program. Organizers say it brings them joy seeing these relationships between kids and their peers, as well as their relationship with local officers, grow. Not only did this program foster relationships between children and the local law enforcement, it also taught them valuable life lessons and how to be a leader. I was always mad now, but I'm actually, I got happy, I'm nice, I made new friends, and I love this program. And I learned that being respectful is a good thing to do. We're told that due to the huge success of this year's program, it will return next year with plans to accommodate even more children who want to get involved. Jill? Thanks, Kristen. Students from different backgrounds.